Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspies CaseBreaks.com coming at you with 2017-2018 Panini Donners Optic Basketball 5 box mega edition random team break number 5. One spot gets you two teams. You know, we're looking for some some nice stuff in here. All right. And this guy who's playing right now. Toronto's up 35-29 on Boston and Donovan Mitchell had a great playoffs too. Let's double it up. And all teams are in right here. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Three and a six, nine times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, three and a six, nine times, nine right down there. We got Drew down to Brad. Three and a six, nine times for the teams. Eight and ninth and final time. After nine, we got the Golden State Warriors down to the Dallas Mavericks. Now before you trade, obviously keep your 2017 NBA draft class in mind. Obviously, you know, Jazz and, you know, the Celtics are going to be the big elite tier rookies there but there's a lot of other rookies in here too drew with the warriors kevin with the bucks matthew with the pistons drew with the wizards kevin with the pacers uh clippers and nets drew with the sixers matthew with the raptors up 35 32 on the celtics right now robert throne with my lakers they got to wake up in game two kings for kevin bulls and jazz as well nice pelicans for drew daniel with the thunder colin with the hawks kevin with the celtics there you go and robert with the grizz Matthew with the Hornets, Brad with the Nuggets, Daniel with the Suns, Derek with the Spurs and Knicks, Kevin with the Rockets, Colin with the T-Wolves, Matthew with the Cavs, Kevin with the Magic Blazers and Heat, and Brad with the Dallas Mavericks. Let's put all that on one page. Let's sort by team by column B. Let's box these up and let's hit the pause button and allow people uh, a chance to trade if they want to. When we come back, we'll see if there's a trade and then the break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, everybody. No deals were done, but there it is right there. On the 5th, Saturday the 5th, five box, mega, on the 5th, five box mega five. So hopefully this will be a mega break here. We're just talking during the trade window. We're talking about how what, what the Raptors are going to do. Are they going to make it 2-2? Two, two? OG and Obi being left wide open giving the Raptors a win and making the series interesting now. Leading a little bit right here. That was a crazy play. Um, yeah, that was, that was yesterday. Sean, because I think we're on number, Chronicle number five now for the mixer. So yeah, we did that yesterday. That video should be up. Did the Sixers hire Chauncey Billups as GM? Coach? I did not hear that news. Oh, you're saying how about Sixers hiring Chauncey Billups? He wants to coach now. Okay, I, th I thought GMing was... Why not Chauncey Villas? I mean, we already know what Ty Lue can do as a coach. <laughs> you know, I mean, had the luxury of, of LeBron James on that squad too, but... I mean, why not Why not see what Chauncey Billups can do? He's been on a lot of teams. He's, he's a winner. He won a championship. You know... Well liked in every locker room I think he's ever been in. Every fan base seems to love him in every team that he's been on. You know, I think has has done well in like with media and stuff in the media space. He knows what he's doing. I'm surprised he's I'm surprised he hadn't been picked up somewhere. In, I thought Detroit wasn't. 
Maybe a year or two ago, I thought Detroit was had a GM spot open or something like that. I'm surprised they didn't snap him up. All right. Let's roll here. There's Lori Markinen, Kyle Kuzma, some rated rookies, Lonzo Ball, DJ Wilson. Kuz and Lonzo will go to the Lakers. That'll be for Robert Throne. The Lori Markin, he's still got some upside, right? Kevin's got the Lori Markin in. More Lonzo. This time in the red yellow. Jonathan Isaac. Rated rookie hollow. These hollows everyone seems to love. Orlando Magic. Kevin with that one. Markel Fultz kind of looked good in the in some playoff games for Orlando. No, could there be some upside for the former number one overall? Buy low. Drew Kerr with the Sixers. There's John Collins and Bam Adebayo. Bam Adebayo's been looking good. Collins going to Colin. John Collins going to Colin Sullivan and the Hawks. And Bam Adebayo going to Kevin R. and the Miami Heat. Miami Heat playing some good basketball. And there's a fox in the box, De'Aaron Fox. Kevin with the Kings. Nice De'Aaron Fox. There's another rated rookie hollow. Got to save all of these. You never know. The hollows are very desirable. If Wayne Selden goes off. That one for the Grizz, Robert Throne. And there's a Jason Tatum. Nice. And a rookie Kings, Donovan Mitchell. Kevin R. with the Jazz. And I think he also has the Celtics. He bought a lot of spots in this break. So there you go. Nice. Nice. Ooh, nice, Rich. Okay, so that'll, that'll be next. I hope. I think. There's Tatum right now. Turnaround jumper from the free throw line. Ooh, in and out. Three boxes to go. Still up by three. Four minutes left in the first half. Trying to make the series 2-2. Two, two. What's the... Uh, what's, the, what's the second game tonight? Why am I blanking on the second game? Is that also on TNT? Daniel Fessman, what's going on? How are you? I don't even know who I'm chasing with the Mavs and Nuggets. Yeah, that was not a, that's not not a super awesome draw. <laughs> um uh, Dennis Smith Jr., Brad, if you get a hollow Dennis Smith Jr., and if he goes off for the Knicks, remember, he was hobby hot for a second. If he goes off,
then you'll be like, man, I'm glad I have that hollow rated rookie from that mega box break that Joe opened for me back on September 5th, 2020. Nuggets. Nuggets, I'm not sure if we're going to ha have a lot of success with the Nuggets here for you. So, apologies. <laughs> Tyler Lydon. I mean, listen, with the way basketball is, though, who thought that, who thought that TJ Warren, you know, was going to be the player that he is today? If you bought low on TJ Warren, I mean his price not might be not might, may not be the most expensive player on the secondary market, but if you bought low on him, there he is right here, TJ Warren. If you bought low on him, nice Donovan Mitchell. That's the crazy thing with hoops is that these kids come out so young, 18, 19 years old that sometimes some players do need, you know, a few years to marinate. There you go. Hang in there, Daniel. Dodge those hurricanes. Jazz, another one for Kevin. That's why basketball... Oh, another Tatum. Basketball, more than any other sport, is where you can see, like, that big turnaround. I mean, like Brad said, he's not going to hold his breath on Dennis Smith Jr. I don't know why I'm top-loading Dennis Smith Jr. The team will take care of that. But, right? He's on a big market team in New York. You know, it's got talent. He's shown it. We know what he can do. Just put it put it in a drawer, Brad. Seriously, I'm I'm not even kidding. I know I'm, I know we joke around a lot here, but I'm not even kidding. Just put it in a drawer and forget about it, and then, and then just you know, in the back of your head, just keep, just keep Dennis Smith Jr. hot streaks in mind, and all of a sudden, that card which might not be much now. If it goes for like 30 bucks, maybe it goes for two bucks now. If it goes for 30 bucks mid-season, why not, right? That's that's profit. Jonathan Isaac, hollow for Kevin. The, the market doesn't react like that with baseball as much, I don't think. You know? Football, maybe. Baseball is more of a long-term investment, I feel like. You get their Bowman card, and then you kind of wait until they've got some all-stars under their belt and stuff like that. But hoops, you can play a shorter-term market with hoops. Like, listen, look up this Kyle Kuzma card right now. <laughs> How much is it going for? Dollar? Five dollars? Maybe? You don't think if Kyle Kuzma goes off next few games suddenly turns into a $40 card. That's how quickly it could turn around. Kawhi Leonard, silver. It's for the Spurs. Then it'll be for Derek. Nice De'Aaron Fox. Another Fox in the box for the Kings, Kevin. And the last box coming up. We'll go through some more orders after this, but I think Rich was saying Hit Parade football sold out. So that should be a fun look with football right around the corner. It snuck up on me, folks. In the middle of all this basketball. Now now my days, I thought the pandemic really screwed up my days. Now my brain is really even more screwed up. Because, because it's the last month of baseball. So I, I'm, in, I'm in stretch run baseball mode in September. But then my head thinks, are we still in May? Is it June? We've got basketball playoffs happening. So I feel like we're still in June, but it's still in September. And then my brain is trying to process the fact that the NFL season is going to start while basketball playoffs are still going on. 
So I'm like, so is it September? Is it June? It's all, it's all mixed up. I'll, I'll, I'll turn around. Bam out of bio, going to the heat, Kevin. Another Donovan Mitchell for Kevin and the Jazz. I mean, got to grade these two to get the max potential out of it. Another Jason Tatum. Hopefully, one of these comes back. Comes back a ten, right? That's the idea. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's that. Another successful five-box random team break of Donner's Optic Basketball from 1718. This Mega Box edition. Thanks everyone for getting in. I'm pretty sure we've got some more, so we'll load up some more five-box breaks of this in the store if you want to run this back and chase some more Tatum's, chase some more Mitchell's, uh, Bam out of bios, among others. So there you go. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'm Joe for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.